Hello guys, whether you're entering the landlord business as an accidental landlord or you're thinking of becoming a full-time investor landlord, this can be a really profitable business. Now you have to take into account there are various costs affiliated with being a landlord and many common mistakes that you should avoid in order to have a profitable business and not have any surprises or run into financial nightmares. Some of the costs are fixed, one-time payments, uh, while other are monthly ongoing expenses. Uh, that is better to know up front so you can budget properly. Uh, remember, becoming a landlord is probably the first step on your financial freedom, uh, financial independence. But no matter if it's your first, second, or third house, there are many but meaningful, uh, meaningful details that you need to be aware of. Uh, to help potential landlords understand what some of these mistakes might be, industry experts have prepared an insider report called 10 Mistakes to Avoid uh, as a Landlord. Uh, I have a copy here in my hand. Number one mistake to avoid is not understanding your local market. Uh, location, 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 keep being the most important word when investing in real estate. And making sure your rental is in a uh, desirable area and it's priced accordingly is number one. Number two mistake is not knowing or understanding the fair housing laws. Before you start looking for tenants, you need to have a handle on fair housing and discrimination laws. Uh, if you like a copy of this free report with all the 10 mistakes, simply leave your contact information in the link below and we will mail, mail you uh, your free copy. If you like this informational video, tag, share and comment below and uh, go survey. Thank you.